Hello everybody, welcome to my channel and today's video. I have an unboxing for you. It is an April box but it's literally come on the last day of April so I'm sorry it's so late but nothing I can do about that at the moment and I shall show you which one it is. It's the latest in beauty. April's edit is the Oh So Natural edit and here it is. So we're going to get right in and show you exactly what I've chosen this month. Now Latest in Beauty is um, obviously a monthly subscription box, slightly different to others out there in that you get to choose the amount of products that you wish to receive, not only the amount but also which ones. They release an edit at the beginning of the month telling you all the products that are going to be available in that month for you to choose. They then release one new product per day. Okay, so, but you don't know throughout the month when those products are going to be released. So sometimes if there's a particular product that you're after or you're interested in, sometimes that might not be released till towards the end of the month. So you've just got to wait and wait, which can be a little bit of a pain when you're waiting for something in particular. Um, you also get to choose the amount of products. So they do a box that's three item, a six item and a nine item box. I get the six item box um, and how much do I pay for it? I pay £10 a month purely because I joined on a special offer in January where I prepaid for the year and it then worked out at £10 a month. So there we go. Let's get into it. Let's see what I chose this month. So here we go. Here's the inside of the box. Alrighty, so first item. This is the OK Pink Clay Sheet Mask. Now then, I kept seeing this sheet mask on the Latest in Beauty website on the pics. And it was one of those I kept thinking, I do fancy trying that. But then there was other things that I fancied instead. So, but this month I kind of needed something to make up my box. Um, so I thought, right time to grab this. Um, I have the Sand and Sky pink clay mask that you, you pop on all over uh, and I really love that. I love the way it makes my skin feel afterwards. So I thought well seeing as though this is in a sheet mask let's give this a go and I think these retail for about four or five pounds each so that is item number one. Item number two, a little bit of an unusual item to choose, I suppose, but I needed some. Uh, these are by Sport FX, and these are their eyelash curlers. My old eyelash curlers that I've had for a number of years finally broke on me uh, a while ago, actually, but two or three months ago. Um, so, and I do know I've been on the SportFX website and these are worth five pounds to buy. Uh, so I thought again, it seems though I needed something to fill my box up and these were still on there. Uh, so yeah, I've chosen some eyelash curlers. There we go. Next item in the box. Now then, again, I've been looking at this for a while, not particularly on the latest in beauty site, but just in general. And it is uh, by the Basic Beauty Tools. I don't know if you're going to be able to see this. And it is the Sponge Cleaner. This is a full size product, uh, and it's like um, it's like a, a gloopy gel. Um, it's 250 mils, liquid foundation, blender, cleanser. So you can use it for your sponges, uh, your beauty sponges. You can also use it for your brushes as well. Now then, I, uh, I hope you all know, I've actually got a Style Pro brush cleaner, uh, an electric one. And uh, my theory is that I'm gonna pop a few drops of this in to the water in there and hopefully clean my brushes using this. Um, I'm not quite sure, I think this is worth about six or seven pounds uh, to buy, so yeah, nice product to try. 
So each, because I pay £10 for this six item box, literally each of these items I think cost me about £1.70 to buy, £1.65, something like that. So to get a full size sponge cleaner or brush cleaner for that amount of money is alright, isn't it? And the next product I chose, oh, now this, this is why my box is late because I was waiting for this coming on. Um, this again is a full size product. It is a 200 mil, uh, 250 mil tube and it's by the company Kind Natured. It's the Lime and Mandarin Body Wash. Oh, I just thought it sounded divine. Um, it's vegan friendly and it's 97% natural. Oh yes, you can smell the citrusy lime in there and the mandarin. That's going to be fab for trying to wake me up in the morning. Um, and it is huge, it's absolutely massive. So again, uh, I think this is worth, I think this is worth about £5 to buy. Something like that, might be even a little bit more. Um, so yes, I've been waiting for that coming on. And the other product had been waiting coming on as well um, were these. I'd seen them um, when they did their edit at the beginning or the end of, of March. Um, yeah, I'd seen these at the end of March and again, I just thought they were a really cool item uh, but they didn't actually come available on the website until later on in the month. And these are by Tabitha Eve and they are the reusable makeup remover pads. You get five in a pack, um, and they're completely re reusable, reusable. I'll take one out if I can. They're organic cotton. They're handmade as well, so they're not like completely um, uniform they they are sort of slightly different sizes and stuff like that but they feel divine you've got a smoother side here and sort of a fluffier side here um so yeah so always trying to look after the environment and reduce use of wipes and and cotton pads you know cotton wool pads um so yeah so that's item number five and item number six was the Hero product or the Hall of Fame product this month for Latest and Beauty. It was actually a duo item but you got two products and it was just one pick and it's Molten Brown. It is the uh, Heavenly Ginger Lily. You get the bath and shower gel and you also get the body lotion. There we go. Now I'm not a massive body lotion fan. Um, so this, I don't know what I'm going to do with it. I might save it, I might use it. I might pop it in a giveaway or something like that or pass it on to a friend. Um, but certainly the bath and shower gel was the one I was after. These are both 100ml uh, little bottles. Um, and Molten Brown's not a cheap make. I think again, I think these. this is probably, the two together is probably worth about £10. Oh, that does smell nice. Oh, you can smell the ginger and the lily, but neither are overly heavy. Mmm, yummy. Really nice. So, that is my Oh So Natural edit for the month of April. Um, so, I've got the Molten Brown body wash and body lotion. I've got the Kind Natured Lime and Mandarin uh, body wash. I've got the Tabitha Eve reusable makeup cleanser or remover pads got the Sport FX eyelash curlers, the Beauty Tools sponge cleaner or brush cleaner and the OK Pink Clay sheet mask. Um, I'm really chuffed with that box, I'm really pleased with what I've chosen this month but let me know what you think in the comments section down below. Thank you for watching as always, I hope you've enjoyed this little video. Uh, if you are new to my channel, the warmest of welcomes. Thank you for finding me. If you've not already, please consider hitting that subscribe button, either the red one down below or the circular icon with my face in it, which will appear here shortly. Make sure your notification bell is turned on to all. That way YouTube will let you know every time I drop a video. At the moment, that's about three or four times a week, although sometimes I do catch you all out and drop a bonus one, so I wouldn't want you to miss out on that. 
Okay, everybody, I think that's it for today. Enjoy the rest of your day. Keep safe, keep well, keep inside as much as possible. And I shall see you in the next one. Bye.